Hey guys, Steve here from Saxon Gaming. So welcome back to Skyrim. Now, I know this has been a, a few days off just now. Um, basically, the other guys have uploaded some videos. So I thought, you know what, I'll take a break for a bit of editing just for now. Uh, so we've had a little break. So we're going to get this up for you guys today. Um, I'm going to try and post every other day for this stuff, for Skyrim and that sort of stuff if we can, so we don't lose the following. In any case, let's hop right in. So basically, since the last video, Obviously, some comments I've received taken on board. Uh, so we have actually skipped. Not in the, not in the mini storyline. Because I'm on you PC, I can open up my command console and do wonderful things. So one of the things I have done has actually increased our level and some of our skills. So if we scroll along, I haven't gone too overboard with it. So like we just one hand is now 55, blocks now 50, and heavy armor is now 45. Uh, level 15, so we just get ourselves a bit of a boost, we can hunt together, you know, so we have, uh, so it saves all the grinding in, in game footage, I've we actually get the good stuff the in. Anyway, without further ado, let's continue. Um, ah, we've got to talk to this guy just now, because we're doing the companion quests. There you are. I did. Your time, it seems, has come. Uh -oh. Last week, a scholar came to us. He said he knew where we could find another fragment of Wuthrad. He seemed a fool to me. If he's right, the honor of the companions demands we seek it out. I've been hunting on my own for oh, really? years. Fighting people is uh, difficult. This is a simple me? errand, but the time is right for it to be your trial. Carry yourself with honor, and you'll become a true companion. Farkas will be your shield sibling on this venture, Well, He'll answer Gee, any thanks. questions you have. Try not to disappoint, or to get him killed. Oh, gee, thanks. <laughs> Don't worry about me. <laughs> <coughs> All right, let's have a look. Come on, Vargas. I go. hope you've read it yourself. So I'm told. Let's see if you impress. All right, let's go. Until next time. Come back up. Did this actually change a weapon? I actually got the wrong thing on. There we go. Give it a dead. No, we don't want that one. Where's our band? There we go. That's more like it. There we go. Alright guys, so what we're going to do, what I'm going to do just now more like, is I'm going to skip the footage from here. Uh, so we're going to run all the way. All the way to over here. Uh, if there's anything funny on the way, I'll include it. In any case, see you in a second. Okay guys, so I thought I'd show you this real quick. Uh, I have actually got some new swanky armor. Look all shiny and bronzy. Oh, we got a horse! Look at my amazing horse! Alrighty. So we've also got a little um, giant camp down here. Now I'm tempted to raid it. Actually, we might do that actually. We might raid that actually. We've got to be like Urban Ninja right now. Urban Ninja. That's what we're going to be. I'm, I'm coining that phrase, Urban Ninja. Okay, so this is my tactic, because I am not stealthy at all. We're going to quick save, because <laughs> every PC game is a favorite button. We're going to run in. Then we're going to try and pick it. And then we're going to... Okay, so we've only got 25 left. Um, I'm going to try my best to find this for you guys. Whoa, there we go. Okay. Nope. Take that for seven, though. Uh, that's worth something. And now we run away as fast as we can. <laughs> Before we are getting attacked and killed. <laughs> that's my tactic for raiding giant camps. <laughs> anyway, guys, we're going to continue onwards. I'll see you in a second. Okay, guys, we're just outside now. Um... Just we go inside as well, I do want to take note, because I think this is such a common thing in all games we play nowadays, and it, it's so underappreciated. I'm not going to lie, it is so underappreciated. I do it myself a lot, but I mean, just look at this. Look at this. Look at that landscape. I mean, Jerry, stop it. Let's just zoom in a bit. Let me get off horse, it'll be a bit easier to see it. I mean, just look at that. Look at the view, and I mean, you just look at the detail. 
and how much work's been put into this landscape. Like, yeah, we've got the dragons, we've got horses, we've got armor. That's all nice and well, but the real beauty of this game is the landscape. Where you're walking, where you're running. Do you know what I mean? And like Little things like this, just like knocked over trees and skeletons coming up to try and chop my head off. Stuff like that, you know. It's it's just really beautiful to see in games, you know. Very, very... Oh, hell no! Motherfucker trying to kill my horse! How dare you try and kill my amazing horse! Oh, look at my horse! Look at it! Yeah, anyway, guys, I thought I'd include that there. Um... Because I think it's something that's genuinely underappreciated, and it really should be, you know, more looked into. Oh, that is actually really nice to see. You know, it's not much, but imagine this entire world if it was just. I mean, apart from Borderlands, like more cartoony. The way, like everything else looking really beautiful, then there's some cartoony shit. You know what I mean? It just it it, it wouldn't go. You know, and. If they didn't put such attention to detail into this world, it would be ten times less exciting to explore. Um, I thought I would include that for you guys, because I do generally think it's such a beautiful aspect that it just gets missed out all the time. We also give this a go here. Uh, let's get our, prof uh, our professional lockpicking skills to work here. We will find it. Oh. There we go. Who needs to be a master lock picker when you have looks like these? Stole that line from Call of Duty, but oh well. <laughs> All right, guys. So what we're gonna do just now? Uh, we're gonna. Uh, I can't run away up there again now. Where's my horse? Amazing horse. Why are you over there? Amazing horse. I need you. I summon thee. Can you name my horse? I would like to be able to name my horse. Alright, so we've got our amazing horse now. Let's go. Also, sorry for any coughing or sniffing, guys, but as usual, I've got um, a bit a bit of a stuffed up. I try not to do it too much for the sake of the video. Alright. Now, be a good horse and stay there. Alright. So, as well as obviously I showed you at the start of the video, uh, this is a companion quest we're doing right now. So, I don't know, if, obviously, if you guys have never seen it, I won't spoil it, but this is a good quest. This is this was a very exciting quest when I first played this. Very exciting. Let's push forward. Looks like someone's been digging here. Oh, one more skill crates, we'll level up, nice. Okay. If I remember rightly, there's actually a part of this mission that's quite cells. difficult and quite annoying actually. Oh, shit. Come on, you little bit. Oh! What? More! Okay. Sometimes these actually have gems on them. They're nice to search, actually. See, look, look at that shit. Look at that shit. Increase your health. Wait, what's the one we've already got on, actually? Oh, we've got level up. We'll save that, though. We'll save the level up. It actually restores all your health, and in the heat of the moment, <laughs> restoring all your health can be useful. Uh, let me see. So we've got this. Increase your magicka. We actually need to use this for our health. So I don't really use spells. So. Oh. Ah! Lucky hit. 
Wow, she's gorgeous. She, she really wants to kill him. She's like, like, fuck you, man. I don't care if I hit you in the face. I want to kill him. <laughs> oh, knock, knock, bitch. <laughs> oh, man. Some, some, some things you get in this game are hilarious. So he's got some gold. He's got some gold. Let's press forward. Hits it with a mace. Doesn't break. Now, they've seen these in films. It's supposed to be funny. But when, like, you touch a vase, it falls around and smash it into a million pieces. They need to learn a thing or two from Skyrim here. No matter what you do, it just. They do not break. You can hit this thing off a truck and it would still Watch be intact. There, brother. Okay, jeez. That, that, where I come from, that's a sign of appreciation, but okay. Or so I'd have him believe. Uh, oh. Okay. Also, guys, quick question for you all. Um, do you prefer me to play in first person, third person, or both? Let me know. Obviously, I prefer both. Like, when I'm actually in combat, I prefer first person, if you can't already tell, especially in close places. Because obviously, if you're running around like this, it's nice to see and all. But when you're in, like, really small tunnel bits like this, it can be a bit annoying, a bit encumbersome. Like, especially, like, you're right here, and bam, you're right there again. It just zooms you right in. It can be quite annoying. But obviously, if you prefer to see it in third person, just let me know. Hit me up in the comments there, and I'll, I'll adjust my gameplay accordingly. Okay. Now that's shut. I feel that it's going to open. But I don't think it does, if I remember rightly. Okay, so there's actually... There was a potion in here, I think. Oh yeah, here's a good bit, here's a good bit. This is a bit where I both shit my pants and had, you know, gamegasms beyond control at this point. Damn it. No, I was watching this. Is, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. In fact, just because it's so beautiful, we're going to go outside and be cheeky. Now look what you've gotten yourself into. No worries. Just sit tight. I'll find the release. I'm invisible, apparently. What was Shit. that? It's time to die, dog. We knew you'd be coming here. Oh, here it is. Here You're it is. Mistake, companion. Which one is that? It doesn't matter. He wears that armor. Dies. Here it comes, my favorite bit of the game. None of you will be alive to tell it. Oh, shit, said in the fan. Oh, there it is. Oh, he's fucking him up. Now, this is the bit where you shoot yourself. He just turns around and he runs off. Oh shit! Here he comes. Then oh look, he's in there. Honestly, I when I first saw that, I basically you. shit myself. I thought, "Fuck, he's gonna rip me apart." <laughs> it's a blessing given to some of us. We can be like wild beasts, fearsome. Oh no! Only the circle have the beast blood. Prove your honor to be a companion. Eyes on the. We should keep moving. Still the Draugr to worry about. Now, I really like silver weapons, but for some reason, they they didn't do much of them. They just left them as they are. Because I really like the silver weapons in this game. I think they just look, I don't think they genuinely just look really cool. Like, I mean, look at that. I actually like silver weapons, but they. they just, I mean, the sword design here is actually a bit. It's actually decent. A bit wide, the blade. Uh, a bit thick as well. The, the, the guard is quite thick as well, actually. Pommel is nice. But, um... No, the blade rest is... For the game, it looks really cool. But in reality, uh, this blade's too thick. Much too thick. Um, it's unnecessary weight, basically. So even this, this is, this is just like, what's supposed to be a long sword, and even, even the... The guard is still massive and the blade is still overly thick. And I know, obviously, a lot of you think, well, it's heavier, do more damage. 
no, no, it just, it, it won't, it won't. <laughs> um, little uh, sword less of you guys there. And don't believe me, I am no expert on swords. Actually, there's um, actually everything I know, I know, know that because there's actually another YouTuber I watch. He you know, covers a lot of like medieval swords and that sorts of things. Ah, oh, forgotten his YouTube channel now. Uh, I'll have to um, I'll leave a link in the description below. I've actually forgotten the name of his channel. Um, it's like it's, it's scroll or something like that. Uh, I can't remember exactly it now, but we'll leave a link in the comment, link in the uh, description below. Uh, do check him out. He's not really game coverage. He's more like swords and weapons and that sort of thing. You know. He does cover some games. I know he played Chivalry uh, on like, a couple of his videos. Um, but I know it's primarily sword coverage, medieval tactics, and obviously te techniques for fighting. You know. Um, he's actually got a really cool video on how effective Skyrim weapons are. <laughs> and it's actually quite good. Um, it's, I'll definitely say check him out. He's uh, it's quite 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 entertaining to watch sometimes, especially when he when he just like he hit, gets people bitching at him and he just like replies. The replies are so funny. All right, so let's look through here. Okay, so I'm gonna be all on necrophiliac and steal all the shit out of these, just because I can. Oh, you're alive. Is someone there? No. I'm not here. Why would I be here? Watch this, watch this, watch this. Please open the door. Boom! <laughs> oh, I'm done with that one. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, he just saved me there. Now, this is weird. This is augmented. Or enchanted, rather. But there's no enchantment. That's really weird. Uh, That's brutal. This did fucking damage, though. That's all you got! Mercy? I don't do mercy, my friend. Alright, let's see what says Oh, yeah. I think, um, maybe not this video. Next video, I think I'm going to do some blacksmithing as well. Um, after this. I'm not going to boost, though. Well, I'll actually do it genuinely. We have to buy all the ores. Spend like the next four hours grinding and that sort of thing just to get all the gold and stuff I needed there. Um, I know, obviously, I know, obviously, you guys might not find it so believable, but um, it is pretty intense. I don't know, uh, some of you guys might sure any of you who's played, you know, so sort of surely knows exactly the tactic I'm going to use for it, which is basically like you, you get like you just go around all the, all the places. Buying all the ingots, going to all the mines, getting all the ores, then basically just building iron daggers repeatedly, um, over and over and over again, until you just eventually get smithing level 100. Uh, once you hit level 100, the next thing you can really do is you literally there's a there's an orc settlement, and it's actually got an ebony mine. And respawnable ebony ingots and ores. And oh shit, this is a master lock, isn't it? Right, let's start off down here. Okay, so this one's gonna be dodgy. Fuck. Bugs. Got a feeling I'm not gonna be able to do this one. That felt like it moved then. I'm not sure though. No, it didn't. Alright, so we're gonna go to the next side now because we're starting to run out of lock picks. Um. Okay, this one's good. 
Okay, so I'm having trouble finding this one actually. We might have missed it. Uh, fuck. Uh, if we get down to like three lot of picks, we'll skip this and we'll come back to it. Okay, so two more attempts, guys. Two more attempts. Oh, we got one more attempt. Oh, yes. <laughs> All that time we went right past it. Oh, shit. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so we're actually maxed out now on an inventory. Oh, hello. Oh, very nice. Alrighty, so that was close, guys. We almost, we almost lost all our lockpicks on that one. Jeez. Hey, watch it. Oh, excuse me. Have we been through here? I don't know. I'm confused. Let's go down here. Oh, shit. I can take the health potions. Worth a lot. What is cure disease? I'll take those. This is for stamina. I will treat that. Just for shits and giggles. Uh, ooh, very pretty. Let's go through here. Okay, at this point, <laughs> I'm gonna quick save because I just happen to know that this bit sucks balls. We don't really want to be around. We're gonna let. The, they let them do their thing, and this should be. we'll let, um... Good. Oh, I want my thinking off. We'll let them do their thing up there, let them do as much damage as possible. Um... Regenerate some stamina. Yeah, but in this next coming up, coming up bit, it does get quite hard, if I remember rightly. Or at least the very first time I ever did it, <laughs> it was quite hard. Because I wasn't expecting it. And I couldn't do anything to do I basically had to run away and come back. It got that difficult. I just basically just got insta-killed. I just had, like, the bog stand armor. Nothing special. And I just got absolutely murked. Sometimes I wonder why they keep these fucking swords, man. Like, it wasn't there and saying, BAM, it's there. What, does it just fall, fucking fall out his ass or something? Jeez. I do wonder about people who've had this game sometimes, man. This is adept. Oh, I'm gonna fuck this, I just know. There we go. Uh, boom, boom. That's a scroll, we'll take that. That's just fuck tons of damage. Uh, here's the fun bit. Everyone's fa every PC gamer's favourite key right there. We'd have waited an hour, but oh well. Yolo. Where we save, this is why we saved the level up, guys. This is why we saved the level up. Um, shit. Uh, one hand? Can we do this? No. Fuck. No. Uh, 
Yes. Damn it. No. Not like this. Fuck. No. Uh, not really good at this, am I? <laughs> um, okay, so we might as well do that at some point. What's this? Okay, so we can't do anything in particular there. Uh, I tell you what, we might do blocking. Or we might do heavy armor, actually. Oh, we can't. Fuck. What's the fist of steel? Fuck's sake. Ah. So awkward sometimes. It's our strength. Um, what about one? Fist of steel. What, what does that lead up to, though? Oh, that's a really good one, actually, isn't it? Um. Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Um. So if you wear a helmet, you get such benefits. We're not going to do that, because we're fucking hardcore. Yeah! So what we're going to do, uh, we might do blocking for now. Or well, we might save, actually. Because uh, I, I do want to get conditioning up here. That is a really useful perk. It saves you so much for looting. Oh, fuck. I, I basically can't fuck up now, though. Um... That's sort of why um, I did my uh, favourite key back there because it's kind of uh, brutal sometimes. Um, anyway, you guys let me know. If you want me to use a helmet, say so. I'll use a helmet. Personally, I like the appearance of not having a helmet. But obviously, if you want me guys to go full on, holy shit, this guy looks like a tank, uh, feel free to comment below what you want to wear, that sort of thing as well. Once again, guys, unless you let me know in the comments, I can't tell. If you haven't got, obviously, got a YouTube channel, obviously, do subscribe to our Facebook page. I don't know if I mentioned that yet, uh, but we do actually have a Facebook page. I'm also going to leave that in the description below as well. Um, you know, so if you haven't actually got a YouTube channel, you can actually use that to uh, obviously comment, let me know what you think, that sort of stuff. Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba. Also, um, if Dean hasn't uploaded it already, Dean has done a Who is Dean video. Uh, he's still got to, he might still be uploading now. Let's see what happens. Uh, okay. Well, hello there. I'm, 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 I'm here to buy a pop. Oh, fuck. Oh, idiot. Fail. <laughs> Take it! Like I'm gonna beat your pussy! And that joke was completely irrelevant, by the way. That was completely irrelevant. <laughs> Die! Ooh, brutal. But just to show the relevance of that comment, uh, can we drag? Yeah, we can. Uh, come in, come in, come in. It's Catman. The joke was completely relevant. <laughs> oh, I'm so bad. <laughs> oh, jeez. All right. Oh, fabulous boots. Fabulous boots. Fucking no, no, no offerings. Oh dear. <laughs> Check out, man. Jeez. <laughs> oh, wait. This is. Oh, fuck my life. I just realized what this part is. This is the worst bit. This is the worst bit. Oh, fuck me. I've got Dragon Bone on me. What if I like Dragon Bone on me? Oh, this is the worst bit as well. This bit's horrible. We're gonna save it right here, guys, because this is the worst bit. This is the hardest bit of the entire map. Uh, the rest of the dungeon, after this point, the rest of the dungeon is fine. Uh, this is the hardest bit, though. Oh, 
What? Where's Twinkle Toes? Twinkle Toes, where'd you go? Oh, he's gone to suicide, isn't he? Oh, fuck my life. Well, we better get some experience. Hope if we're lucky, we'll level up here. And. All that shit. But I've got a horrible feeling that basically it's me. I might just hide here. Oh no, they're coming for me. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. <laughs> this is why I said I had to run away. There's like fucking six of them. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Right, let's try to use this as some kind of, some kind of benefit. Let me, homeboy. Fuck, why am I slowed? Shit, I pressed hold. Oh, fuck. Potions, potions. Shit. Oh, fucking tosser. Let's kill him. Oh, fuck my life. Shit, 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 shit. Boost! Yes! Twinkle Toes! Save me! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck Twinkle Toes, why did you die? <laughs> oh jeez man. Oh that was lucky. <laughs> Vampire dust? Oh shit. Okay, so that's the hard bit done. That's the hard bit done. Didn't break a swim, man. See that shit? I'm just too pro emoji for that shit. Too pro emoji. I love a lot. I love what fucking did is run up behind him. Fucking. Oh, that was beautiful. But now, now you guys. Oh, let's give you sword back. I don't. I don't want that shit. Let's give him. The, let's give him that back. Are. Still mace, apparel, shield. There we go, I'm happy with that. But yeah, that's the hard bit done. The rest of this should be easy going now. What? Oh, I'm loving that shit. Now, you'd never normally find something like this in, in this dungeon. Because you're supposed to be at level 5 when you do this. But we're gonna take that because that's actually better than what we've already got, and it looks sexy. Um, you know what, Farkas? Do can you hold shit? We should keep moving. Um, shit. Oh. Okay, okay. So this is one reason why I want that condition to work. It doesn't weigh anything if you wear it. Uh, we're gonna be wearing that though. It does offer more protection, and it does look a bit, and then it does look sexier. It's actually got a really cool helmet as well. This armor. But we are going to have to drop um, our Dwarven armor to compensate for the weight, which is quite sad actually, but the Dwarven armor is pretty heavy. So we'll get that out of the way. How do we look actually? Oh uh, yeah, let's put this way. So we're looking a bit mismatched at the minute, we're looking a bit mismatched. Uh, we've got fabulous boots, fabulous gloves, about it's sort of like we're compensating for something. And it's really nice looking armor on a hood. So we're, we're going to try and match that out a little bit. Try to look as sexy as possible. Uh, what's on here? Nope. Obviously, once again, if you guys want me to wear a particular kind of armor, please don't, please don't say leather, because I'm focusing on heavy armor, and I'll be like level 20 and with like 20 protection <laughs> when I'm supposed to have like 80. <laughs> Fuck. 
I wasn't paying attention. That teaches me for talking a lot picking at the same time. Ah, great. Great. What? Fuck are you swimming. We've also got a nice amount of gold here as well. We've got nearly 10,000. I hope that's an indicator of how much grinding I've been doing. <laughs> oh, great, we can't even open that door. Fuck my life. up here. Okay, so we've got a key for that. That's nice. Alright guys, so we're nearing the end of the nearing the end of the uh, quest now. Well, rats are a really good way to level up your uh, blocking as well. You just let them hit you. You have your like shield up. Right? Like really effective for it. What's, what, the, what the hell is in here? You open a door. There's gonna be. Isn't there? Yeah, I thought so. Oh, what? Twinkle toes. Well, don't push me forwards. Right, while well, he's distracted by Twinkle Toes, we better um, kill this thing. Yeah, well, he's. Oh no, he's finished with Twinkle Toes. What? Fuck you, man. Oh shit. did not. Oh well. But anyway guys, as I was saying before, we are getting near the end of this quest. Um, I don't want to record for too long because the last video I did, it was basically good, it was good Steve, but fortunately it was too long. A bit boring to watch. So, like, it's nice to watch it all, but it takes too long. It's boring. So I am going to compensate by... I might have to do some editing here to try and uh, tone that down just a little bit. Well, we'll see what we can get done. Okay, bada bum 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 bada bum 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 I tell you what I really do like, the looting system in Fallout 4. That's why did I pick that up? Oh we're not in combat anyway. No. Um but the looting system in Fallout 4, like you just you don't actually go into it, you hover over it. And it brings, it basically automatically brings up this menu. And you can actually just scroll through it and walk away. You don't have to press any button, just look over, scroll, pick, leave. It's really, really quick, really easy. Okay, so we're coming up to the uh, bit where we get a shout, and yeah. Then shit gets real. So we're gonna get this shout, first of all. Fire breath! We're gonna pull out our favourite button and we're gonna pick this up and then get attacked. Anything good in here? That's a glass bow actually, that's really good. Um, we can actually drop. Okay, so we're 11 over. Wow. Uh, we can drop the battle axe. Why did I equip that? I'm such an idiot. Uh, apparel, shield, weapons. What a moment. We can store this and we should. Yeah, yeah, yeah there we go. Alright. Let's get.
get her! Yeah! And I failed. Yay. Ah, uh, shield best kill. Watch there, brother. I would shut up. I'll take the easy ones, you take the hard ones. You're making me angry. Ooh, I'm shaking in my boots. Bitch. Well that worked. <laughs> I kill. Oh shit. I'm gonna crush you. Oh. Uh. Uh. Get get back here. I'll kill you. Where are they running? I'll rip you in half. Shield bash for the win. Get him. Oh wait a minute! I think this is the last one. Oh shit! You the cool dude. No, it's... Yeah, that's the dude we got. Oh, that's quite a lot of pressure. Get it with fire! Get it with fire! <laughs> I tell you what, we're being stupid. We've got silver swords. This will do more damage. We're gonna leave him to his fate. Just okay. Look at that! One hit kill. Your good is dead. Let's go, man. Oh, hand. Everybody was coming for my dear. It's also faster as well. Yeah. Hey, that's awesome. Is he even? What is he doing? I was expecting more of a fight actually. I thought the boss guy was gonna come out there and be a badass with a spiky helmet and all sorts, but apparently no. Alright, so we're gonna skip. One second, guys. Show dash for the win. <laughs> um, now, they might have some gold and them and that sort of thing, but we're gonna skip all that. Uh, maybe the like, big ones. But... Uh, he was the toughest enemy, he hasn't really got him alone, so we're gonna leave the rest. Just put maybe there might be about a hundred gold in looted. That's about it. Um So we come to we come to the end of the quest guys. Um so we're gonna run outside. Uh, get a nice cinematic view, that sort of thing. So I like to be flashy. Uh but anyway guys, this was obviously the companions quest. Well, the first mission of the companions quest. If you'd like to see more of the Companions, we'll do more of the Companions. I'm really hoping you're going to say yes, for obvious reasons. Twinkle Toes over there is the biggest giveaway to that. If obviously you don't get any replies, then I'm going to go on my favourite assumption of saying you want me to, so I'm going to do more of it. Um, oh, it's night time. Very nice. So what we're going to do just now, guys... Where's Amazing Horse? Yeah, so what we're going to do just now, then. We're going to end the video here. Uh, thanks, for, thanks for viewing guys, uh, thanks for sticking with this one here, I know obviously these videos are a bit longer now, I'll try to tell you about half an hour, if I can, so I might edit out certain bits, to try and compensate for that, anyway guys, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, definitely check out um, the other channels I mentioned before, and the Facebook page, you know, all the support is greatly appreciated, and until the next video.